These right here are some extra, extra, and I mean extra juicy baked chicken thighs. So flavorful, so delicious, so amazing, and very easy to make. And I'm about to show you how it's done. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, rock that notification bell so you don't miss out on the latest video. Leave your boy a like as well as a comment, and let's get started. To begin, we're gonna be using six chicken thighs. These are bone in with the skin on. I'm just gonna go ahead and drizzle a little bit of olive oil on these bad boys, give them a nice little massage and make sure they're all well coated in that olive oil. Next, we're gonna move on to the dry seasoning that we're gonna be using to get our chicken perfect. On the screen here, I've listed everything you're gonna be needing to get that thing well seasoned up. And you know the motto, ain't no bland chicken over here. We about to go crazy and get this chicken well coated. Guys, you wanna get all the little crevices of the chicken, get underneath the skin. Make sure every little square inch of this chicken is well seasoned up guys because you know no bland chicken over here like i always say so this next step is optional but i think it just makes it a complete meal guys i'm gonna drop in some baby potatoes chopped in half as well as some onions some carrots some bell peppers i'm gonna drop those all in the pan guys before I get that chicken in there. This is just, you know, it just makes it more complete. And I don't know about you, but I love this little medley that we got going on. It goes absolutely perfect with this chicken, along with a side of rice or whatever that you like. But I love throwing these veggies in there. It's a nice little touch. Once I have all those veggies in there, I'm just gonna go ahead and grab my chicken thighs and put them right on top of all these. Get them all in that pan ready to pop in the oven and you want to go ahead and already have your oven preheated to 350 degrees guys and you want to go ahead and pop these in the oven like i said at 350 for one hour you ain't got to touch it you ain't got to look at it just let it do its thing for that one hour and this is the end result guys absolute perfection i'm trying to tell you and do yourself a favor get you a spoon and scoop up all that juice on the bottom of the pan and just pour it right on top of the chicken oh my goodness i'm trying to tell you that that's a lot of flavor right there sitting at the bottom of the pan go ahead and scoop that up pour it on the top of your chicken and yours will be looking just like mine's guys so amazing this will press anybody you feed it to because it's just that good i'm trying to tell you i hope you guys enjoyed watching i enjoyed making this recipe as well as eating it guys because it was delicious i also want to give a special shout out to all of our channel members cj william blaney bow dimple 1021 nigel the realist brendan van halter and ashley stacy denise freeman appreciate all you guys our membership has a lot of cool perks. Hit that join button down below to find out more about it. And like I said, hope you guys enjoyed watching. I'll see you on the next video.